ever pondered the twists and turns that unfold behind the scenes of reality TV shows, especially those unexpected departures and even more surprising returns? Well, buckle up because we're delving into the sensational roller coaster ride of Natalie Parham's journey on Married at First Sight. Picture this, Natalie, a 32-year-old physiotherapist from Melbourne, fails to connect with her groom, 28-year-old Collins Christian, on their honeymoon. Frustrated and disappointed, she decides to quit the show during a dinner party, leaving everyone, including Collins, in shock. But, as they say, the show must go on. The very next day, Natalie makes a surprising return, ready to give the relationship another shot despite Collins's unpredictable behavior. Finding solitude and time to reflect, she decides to stick around, but with a stern warning. If Collins continues his superficial performance, she's out. Collins, visibly stunned but delighted by her return, agrees to her terms. Now, here's where things get interesting. Natalie, back in the apartment suite, confronts Collins about his behavior at the dinner party. She expresses her disappointment, how she had spiraled without his support. She lays down some ground rules, insisting on taking things day by day, even opting to stay in a separate apartment to maintain her personal space. But when Natalie asks Collins if he's ready to give their relationship another shot, he appears hesitant. After a bit of back and forth, they both agree to try again, though their certainty seems shaky at best. Flashback to Monday night. Natalie calls it quits on her marriage to Collins at the first dinner party. The announcement, made halfway through the night, stirs a whirlwind of reactions among the cast. Natalie, far from her usual bubbly self, delivers a heartfelt goodbye, visibly distressed, signaling the end of her journey on the show, or so it seemed. Collins, echoing her sentiment, acknowledges the difficulty of their decision. Behind the scenes, he breaks down, overwhelmed by the sudden end of his reality TV journey. The reactions from their fellow contestants are mixed, with some expressing skepticism over Collins's display of emotion. Lauren Dunn openly criticizes him, suggesting his performance is Oscar-worthy, while Jaden Einord hints at Collins's insincerity, contrasting it with Natalie's genuine distress. So let's recap. Natalie's unexpected departure followed by her surprising return, the confrontation with Collins and the mixed reactions from the other participants all make for a gripping reality TV narrative. It's a testament to the unpredictable and often tumultuous world of reality TV, where emotions run high, decisions are questioned, and the pursuit of love is a winding road filled with unexpected turns. And this, dear listeners, is just one chapter in the saga of Married at First Sight. Stay tuned for more.